was summoned at his castle on a matter of utmost importance. Tell your king, my daughter and I will arrive tomorrow. Yes, your majesty. Do I have to go with you, father? I can't stand that awful Princess Marie. You don't have to like her, Kala, but you must try to be nice to her for the good of both kingdoms. It's your royal responsibility. I know how you feel, Sonny. I get some pretty rotten jobs, too. And some gorgeous clothes. Oh, I wish you were going with me, Sonny. So do I. I never get to go anywhere. Uh, Princess Kala? Quick, hide! We've come for your luggage, m'lady. Uh, but I'm not ready yet. Oh, I'm sorry, Your Highness, but the ship must sail with the tide. It's the King's orders. Well, uh, looks like I'm going after all. Oh, dear! Hi, Kala. Have you seen Sunny? We've been looking all over for her. Yes, she's in that trunk, and they're taking it to the royal sailing vessel. Uh-oh. Gruffy said to stay out of trouble. We gotta get Sunny back. Did you expect? Well, she sure hasn't changed. Kala, let me out of here! Sunny, I almost forgot. Are you all right? Yeah, but it's no fun riding in the baggage compartment. <gasps> oh, no! Look what you've done to my gown! I'll never get these wrinkles out by tonight! But it's not my fault! Oh, you're right, Sonny. I'm sorry. I'm being a royal pain. Well, you're not the only one. We'll really be sunk. But, Cal, I always sneak into fancy banquets at Dunwin. We're not in Dunwin anymore, Sonny, and I'm going to have enough trouble with Marie. I don't need to worry about you, too. Kala, aren't you ready for dinner yet? Coming, Father! Did you see how smug Marie looked? I did nothing tonight but step on everyone's toes, thanks to you, Sonny. I'm sorry. You should be sorry. Oh, I wish you weren't here. But I thought you wanted me to come. That's before I knew how much trouble you'd be. <sighs> well, there's more to being a princess than just picking up the right fork. So tomorrow, I'll show Marie who's top princess around here. <laughs>